Hey guys, I'm here with another Harry Slatkin haul. I have a haul that I'm super excited to talk about. These are new candles that are be coming out very shortly on QVC. I think within like the next week or so they're going to be available. And I'm super excited to talk about them. It is the new Ice Cream Collection. I love ice cream, so these are right up my alley. Collection lids, or candle jars, except these are, the lid is different like that. It has the, I forget what that's called. It's just like little circles on the end. I think they call that a certain kind of style. Green color goes all the way around. And then it has the mint green top lid with this monogram on the top there. Very pretty. And this is just white wax with three wicks, of course. And this one reads, Iced Peppermint Crushed White Chocolate Crystallized Sugar Whipped Cream. Oh, it's so good. Mmm. So, so good. It's a little bit different than what I thought it was going to be like. Sometimes a lot of these candles lately have been a little bit different than what I'm expecting them to be. Because automatically when you see mint delicious chocolate chip you're gonna think it's gonna be like mint chocolate chip like you know bath and body works mint chocolate chip and um, all the different ones they've had different variations of the mint chocolate candles and through other companies that have mint chocolate it's usually just like a really uh, just a minty like milk chocolate type of scent this one definitely minty but it's it's more spearmint i get spearmint right off the bat I'm just, when you open that candle and smell it, you're just like hitting the face with like spearmint. It's more spearmint than peppermint to me, even though it says iced peppermint in the description. I'm getting spearmint. I kind of kind of get peppermint as well in there, kind of, somewhat. It's maybe spearmint mixed with a little peppermint, but definitely more of a spearmint to me. But then underneath that you can really pick out that white chocolate it's definitely white chocolate not like milk chocolate or like a dark chocolate it's, it's like a white chocolate type of scent mixed with that spearmint slash peppermint kind of mint scent and then i kind of do maybe even get like a little bit of a little bit of like whipped cream if you had like a the mint ice cream and you put it at a shop or like on a shake or something even and they have like a little bit of whipped cream on the top of there and maybe a cherry or something yeah i can get that and of course what was the other thing uh crystallized sugar of course you know ice cream is gonna have sugar in it so yeah really good it surprising like i said that i'm getting spearmint normally in the mint chocolate chips you you just get like more kind of a peppermint or just like a basic kind of mint scent but this is definitely like a spearmint scent to me but it's really good and i bet this is going to be really good. It almost kind of smells like, when you first smell it, it's almost like sugary spearmint gum, kind of, a little bit. And the next one is Ooey Gooey Salted Caramel. And this one is in kind of a brownish, tan brownish color stripes on there, all the way around. And on the lid is the same. It's a little bit lighter, a little bit lighter color than the stripes. The lid is sugar. So this one's good too. It's definitely caramel. You get the caramel, that salted caramel, and I do get a little bit of maple. The maple and the toffee and that butterscotch. You kind of get a little bit of all that in there. It's not like too much of one of them. It's not like, it's the maple's a little bit lighter. It's not like super maple-y, like, you know, pancake syrup and stuff like that or anything. And it's not like super butterscotch. It's just a little bit of everything. It's just very lightly, the salted caramel's in there and the maple syrup honeyed nuts. It says honeyed nuts. I. So it can maybe be a little, it's not super, it doesn't have a super nuttiness to it, but maybe just a little bit way back in there. And then, um, of course, the butterscotch, butter toffee, and dark brown sugar. 
Yeah, I could get dark brown sugar, definitely. Definitely good dark brown sugar mixed with that toffee, that butterscotch, that caramel, and that little bit of maple. It's good. It's really nice. And just a tad bit of maybe the nut, the, the nuts, the nuttiness in there. Um, it's kind of similar to a lot of other salted caramels, like different salted caramel scents from different, you know, Bath and Body Works and different companies have had many caramel scents, the salted caramel scents. It's similar to that, but it's not, what I like about this one is it's not too much. Sometimes those scents can be too much and like just, ugh, too sickeningly caramel and salty and just a, a little bit too overwhelming. This one's very nice. It's, it's, it's put together and it's not too sickeningly sweet. Mm, it's really good. I like that one. It just smells like, yeah, good, nice caramel, ooey, ooey, salted caramel ice cream or even like just the topping on top of the ice cream maybe even kind of so excited to try that one out and next we have creamy dreamy vanilla this one is in kind of a say kind of an off-white cream colored stripes around this one goes all the way around just like the other ones same color on the top of the lid this one reads Madag Madagascar vanilla bean, caramel, cream, cinnamon, and crystallized sugar. Mmm. This one's so good too. This one, oh, it's so good. It's not like your typical vanilla scent that you normally would think of like most vanilla scents. I get definitely like a, it kind of comes off like a vanilla extract. It's like a creamy vanilla extract scent. You definitely get the Madagascar vanilla bean and caramel cream. Maybe just a little bit of caramel in there. It's not like real caramel, nothing like the ooey gooey caramel one. You can maybe just have a little hint of the caramel mixed with that vanilla bean. And then of course the, uh, the crystallized sugar of course is in ice cream. And then uh, cinnamon. There's a little bit of cinnamon too. Not super cinnamony, but it, there's a little bit of cinnamon, a little bit of cinnamon, a little bit of the caramel cream mixed with that vanilla bean and that crystallized sugar. So I'm thinking that maybe that cinnamon and that caramel in there mixed together with that vanilla bean and that crystallized sugar is maybe making it come off as like vanilla extract, or it could just be the vanilla. It's just kind of a vanilla extract kind of vanilla scent. But it is like a creamy vanilla extract kind of smell almost. But at the same time, it smells just like like a nice vanilla ice cream with some brown sugar in there. I love, when I was little, I used to always put brown sugar sprinkled on my vanilla ice cream. Oh, it's so good. I still do that every sometimes, every now and then. I'll sprinkle some brown sugar on top of vanilla ice cream. It's so good. I love it. So yeah. Mmm, it's really good. Just a really decadent vanilla bean type of scent. Oh, it's so good. I can't wait to burn this one. And this one, of course, could be mixed with anything. It can be mixed, you could mix it with the Mint Delicious chocolate chip. You can mix it with the caramel one. Um, mix it with all the different kinds of candles and scents. You know, vanilla is a good blender scent. And uh, so, yeah. And it would also go really good with this last one here I'm going to show you. This is the one I love the most. I love this one. It is Fantastic Fudge. And this one, of course, has the brown stripes all the way around. And the brown lid with his monogram. And this one, of course, is white wicks, or white wax and three wicks and white wax. And they were all white wax. I don't know if I showed you all the rest of them. They're all white wax. Yes, all white wax and three wicks. Fantastic Fudge reads dark chocolate, espresso drizzled caramel, creamy coconut, tonka bean, black vanilla, brown sugar. Mmm. Oh my god, it's so good. Oh, I love this one. If you love chocolate scents, you must get this. It's so good. I... Of course, it's chocolatey. I get the chocolate. And then you really get that espresso, that espresso, they said espresso uh, drizzled caramel. 
kind of, I mean, definitely espresso and chocolate, caramel, a little bit. Well, it's kind of like the vanilla bean. I mean, it's not super caramely like the ooey gooey caramel, but it could have a little bit of caramel in there. I guess they're saying espresso drizzle caramel. Yeah, and then the uh, creamy coconut. I'm not getting coconut. If it is, it's way down in there. But I wrap the bat, I don't really pick up coconut that much. Uh, tonka bean, yes, of course. Black vanilla, I don't, not really sure what black vanilla is. I can get vanilla, a little vanilla mixed in there, but I don't know exactly what black vanilla is, per se. Uh, brown sugar, a little bit, yeah, I can get maybe a little brown sugar in there. But mostly, I'm getting the dark chocolate and espresso mixed together. To me, it's kind of like, kind of similar to espresso bar from Bath & Body Works, because that was coffee with like a little bit of chocolate in there. It's similar to that, but it's way better, in my opinion. And I loved that candle, but this is better because it's got more of a nice decadent chocolate with it. Mixed with a little espresso in there. And it also has a little bit of like chocolate layer cake from Yankee Candle. I kind of... I kind of pick up a little bit of that, but then it's got coffee in there. Of course, chocolate layer cake didn't have any coffee or anything. It was just pure chocolate with like chocolate icing. You could actually get a cake note. This doesn't have any kind of bakery cake note though. So it doesn't have, it's like chocolate layer cake, but without the chocolate bakery cake note or without the cake note. Not that it has the chocolate part of the chocolate layer cake, but not the bakery cake note. Yeah, so it's like, Take an espresso bar and mix it with just the chocolate part of the chocolate layer cake and take out the bakery cake note. Mmm, yes. If you like both those candles, I think you'd really like this because it's so good. I love chocolate scents. And this is so good. I mean, it does smell like... And it, I mean, it comes off like fudge, too. Like a fudge... It could be like a chocolate ice cream or... Even just the fudge going on top of like the vanilla ice cream. And this would go really good with, like I said, with the the vanilla. It would pair really good with that. The vanilla would go good with any of these other ones. Really good. So yes, I love that one. I love them all. I can't wait to try them all. Like I said, they will be available probably within the next week. So keep checking uh, the QPC website. So yes, keep an eye out for these. These are so good. I'm so excited about this ice cream collection. All right, so thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you all in our next video. Bye.